Yeah, isn't it, Andy? Very Event Horizon-ish. What's so interesting downstairs? Just labs and offices. Maybe the shuttle station. Should we go check? Rather not. Got a bad feeling about this. Don't say that. Please, Cat. don't say that. Please, Allie, don't say that. Okay, not going down there. Who's your enemy? Artificial intelligence, I think. We, I don't know, man. Maybe they wanted to keep close to the shuttle station in case something went wrong. I'm really stuck on that one. I'm just worried about his colleagues. That's, that freaks me out, man. Take Big Buddha. Toss him down the shaft. If I can get in there. We haven't... Uh, we got to Theta, um, Marcus. The Theta station, but that's about it. Uh, the, are these crew quarters? Why is Conrad's quarter sealed off? Back up, back up, Conrad. <laughs> I'm gonna mess you up, bro. <laughs> We haven't made it too far. Ooh, pillows. Yeah, it was a drinker. My bad, Skull. My bad, man. This is, I wonder if this is, these are pictures from inside the Ark. Let's clean up Conrad's room. Did I miss something? Why was Conrad's room boarded up, though? There's no, like, no information or anything. I mean, this, I don't know what this is. Master tool safety. I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know what that is. Hey, man, we're at the, we're at the bottom of the ocean. There's Catherine's room. Okay. Hey, that's my room. You want me to bring something? A souvenir? No, it's just memories. <sighs> Alright, I, I feel like we're gonna find something weird about Catherine here. Ooh. Ooh. I seriously doubt you'll find anything useful Ooh. in there. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah, you would say that, Catherine. 
Katie, I find myself watching your face cam more than the game itself because waiting for your prices reactions to this game is hilarious. It's terrifying. Imaging retested a machine today. It was clearly corrupted by WAU, but more importantly, it was assembled in a seemingly primitive way. WAU is the, the artificial intelligence that is kind of um, like making things right, I, I feel like, uh, is the best way to put it. And but it's it doesn't have any emotions or feelings, but it it's definitely not on your side. Like someone is specifically created for WAU to steal. When it activated, the machine mimicked the room and read along with it. At some point, she was scanned and then loaded a simulation inside the digital space. The presentation shock reading was quickly terminated. It scares me how much it reminds me of my AR capsule. Capsule. So it mimicked a person. It mimicked a person. Which is weird. After dissecting the vivarium machine that Reed activated, it's clear that W copied my capsule project to construct the scene to hold the Reed simulation. It's actually very similar in its construction except for one point, where my capsule houses flat people constructed from model neurographs. The vivarium's brain scan lives on. It isn't limited by its content from the originating brain brain scan Reed emerged. The Reed inside the vivarium was a perfect copy. So it is mimicking people. I have it. I can save humanity. I can build an artificial reality capsule that can hold every living member of Pathos 2. I can't figure out how it worked with the Vivarium, but I can replicate the BAU scanning technique using the pilot seats, which is what we were in at the very beginning of the game. They are already prepared with the type of electromagnetic drums needed. This is even easier than I thought. The pilot seats are already set to allow the diffraction and high energy needed to capture the scan. Um, I suspect WAU has been using the seat to steal scans from us for a while. I guess that explains the mockingbirds. The WAU must have stolen scans from the people using the pilot seat and used it as a basis for intelligence in the machines. This is getting so intense. She is, she is essentially... So, she's created this AI copy of people's minds, and it's not limited by the originating scan so that it's not limited at all like it can think for itself and everything with a surprisingly positive reaction from the team we now have officially we have now officially started the art project we're to scan all the people we can find and load them into the capsule then we will launch it into space using the space gun it's nice to think something will live on like that she is the WAU she has to be it's not safe is it saving humanity Mark Sarang killed himself after his scan. He's been suggesting everyone should kill themselves as it would somehow allow them to actually get on the art. But if they kill themselves, it's not really them. It's a copy of them. I'm not sure how that would work. It did trigger a lot of arguments among the staff, and apparently it's my fault somehow. Shrumhire is not happy with me. Hope it will calm down. Oh, this is getting so deep. It's messing with my brain. I love it. What's up, Critty? Mature audiences, is Katie Wolf saying swears? No, I just turned I turned it on to, you know, just to make sure I wasn't breaking any Twitch TOS. Oh, this is this is weird. Richie gave me a set of AI templates I haven't seen before. Richie gave me a set of AI templates I haven't seen before. I folded one of them to make a new friend for Capsule Catherine and her gang of legacies. New way to s simulate turbulence makes the weather system so much better. Implemented Reed didn't go. It's like the Matrix. New try with Reed. Reed won't play nicely with others. She's too real. And Reed is the copy. Reed's the first copy. Yeah, if it's a perfect copy, what is the difference? <sighs> this is messing with my brain, dude. Get out of here. Get out of here, chair. Is a perfect copy even a copy? I don't even... I don't even know, man. This is... Konnichiwa. Cool fan. Thanks. Reminds me of Taipei, my hometown. Well, you know what, Catherine? I don't really trust you, so this fan is going right in the garbage. Along with your theories. Because I do not trust you. Creepy doll. What's in there? I 
didn't step out of the way. <laughs> you have a lot of toys. Huh. You know what, cat? Don't like that either. That's going in the garbage. Along with your evil plans. I'm gonna figure something out about her. Is that the Stargate? No, that's not the Stargate logo. Your teddy bear could use some repairs. Toby always breaks. He's top heavy, so he keeps falling over. Toby, get in the freaking garbage can, man! Get in! Will an AI copy act with the same morality, though, if not in an organic mortal human body? I don't... I, see, you you ask that question, and then you think back to the, the, the guy that Catherine had me stun just to get the chip out of him. And she, she just has... It's like she sympathizes a little bit, but she doesn't have any regard for human life, if that's even what it is. Why is Mark's door a restricted area? That's pretty good. Cool. So those are the health sphere things. That doesn't help me at all. Thanks, Mark. Appreciate the info. Ooh, what is that? Did you know that the human body consists of up to 75 trillion individual cells? They typically don't stay with us till we die. Some live a few days, while others live a few years. We're not affected by their short lifespans, as they're replaced by new cells which help sustain our bodies. I don't think anyone would argue that we ever lose our persona due to this process. Yet we are clearly in a constant state of transformation. <laughs> then how do we remain the same? A continuous flow of thought and perception keeps an unbroken chain of continuity that we know as our self. Our conscious mind is not the pattern of our brain, but a continuous emergent entity based on that pattern. When Dr. Chun populates the Ark, she is capturing a moment of our existence and placing it inside the digital world. Soon you and your digital you will grow apart due to diverging experiences, but for a tiny window, you are the very same. And then what? With unbroken continuity, it will live on. A fulfilling life, no doubt, no less real than the one from which it was plucked. Now remember, you are not your body. You are the emergent entity. That entity just happens to occupy two places at once for a while. If you took away your body, you would simply be the only one you can be. The you inside the Ark. Let your body die and continue on in the digital paradise among the stars. What? What? No! That is not you! That is not you. Uh, Admiral, that is, you could not have said it any better. 
when this game has VR support, the irony will be insane. I've, I've been saying for the past day, like, can you imagine this on the Oculus? Dear friends, when you read this, I will have entered the ark. As I've explained, this is accomplished by ceasing to live as your scan is being completed. To not frighten Catherine, I will do this in secret by folding cyanide salts into chewing gum and placing it in my mouth before seeing her. When I hear her announce completion, I will bite down quickly, causing my own demise. When you discover the truth behind my death, know there's no tragedy to mourn, for I'm victorious. I, will, I advise you all to do the same and join me inside the ark. Sincerely, Mark Serang. So Mark was the one lobbying for suicide. That's weird. Yeah, a copy of you is not you. It's just, it's not. I don't know what this is. Wish I did. But is it really not you? It's if it is a perfect copy. This game has so many people talking about this. It's it's mind tripping. There's no way. Pavlina Martinu, the nature of identity. Does it mean to be human? Does your body or your surroundings confine? Find you all very difficult ideas to approach without having your questions being validated by the practical or mystified by the spiritually minded. In this book, Professor of Philosophy of the Charles University Pray guides you through the history of the great thinkers and what they've thought of, what they have to say about identity. The company is very pleased to hear about your success in making the WAO stationwide presence. We trust you appreciate that a unique opportunity this is, what a unique opportunity this is, and that you will do everything in your power to fully explore and understand this mystery. To do so, you need to ensure that Dr. Jo Johan Ross is able to steer and study the WAU from Alpha without outside interference. In case of an emergency, you may direct Julia Dahl at Omicron to forcefully eliminate any opposition, but please make an effort to avoid extreme actions. The WAU is an important cost affair, and we hope to follow a steady development without setbacks. The supervisory board. Oh, this is getting really trippy. Yeah, that argument. Um, what's up, Tyson? Oh, man, this game is awesome. It's really, really trippy, though. Uh, yeah, it's like saying twins are the same person. They're not. Get out of here, brain. Get chair, man. Get off me. Anything else I'm missing here? I don't. I don't think so. <coughs> this is really, really trippy, man. Did I hear something in there? Yeah, I know. I want to know what is. I can't get through there. I can't smash this glass. Okay, okay. There's no light in here. I gotta make sure the room is clear first. There's a health thing right there. Well, he said, in his little recording, he said the the continuity of consciousness is what matters and keeps the person the same. But if it's a it's an exact copy, there's a break there. This is this is weird, man. I love it. I love it. Put this pillow over there. I don't even know why. <sighs> Last room. Robin. Thanks. All right, Robin. You notice I'm closing all these doors. 
behind me. Yeah, but they'll change. You'd be, it'd be different. It can't be the same, man. It just can't. We're all dying anyway. I'm all in. I put my faith in Serang in the continuity. Oh, just a glasses case. Hairbrush. Uh, I hear that. That thing. That's freaking me out. What is this? A scanner? Hey! It's a VoIP phone! Pictures. Pictures. Cat. Some dude with really tight pants. Oh god. That had to be acres. Dude. They look. Sweeney Todd. They uh they legit killed themselves. This this person killed themselves after they scanned. If they got scanned. Uh no no no. I haven't I haven't gotten anything yet. As far as my guy goes. That's got to be acres, man. Cherry, you know I was in musicals, right? I love musicals. My wife's like, why do you like musicals? I'm like, I just love musicals. Can we get the lights back on, please? Please, can we turn the lights back on? <laughs> I think Catherine's doing this to mess with me. Did I read what was on her desk? I think, uh... It was just pictures, wasn't it? And, like... Can we close this door right here? Yeah, let's do that. Please, let's just get... If I can get in a room... This is where I did my scan. And all the others, I suppose. Oh, it's a pilot seat. Remember? My scan was the first. Had to test the scanner before I could start making promises. That's a pilot seat. Yeah, this is where... This is... I think... At the be I'm sorry, I keep stopping. I think at the beginning, when he got scanned, I think that this guy, our guy, is the first guy who was ever scanned. I, I think he was. I think he's the first guy who was ever scanned. I could be wrong. Is this robot alive? I don't think so. It's attached to something. What's up, burrito? Yeah, yeah, Cherry. I used to do plays and musicals and everything. Chopsticks. Troubleshoot. If that's Windows troubleshooter. Please reset router in the sublevel vault or contact maintenance. Alright. Sublevel vault. Oh, it's so weird. Scan into robot. And the robot can do all this stuff. Yeah, he's he was the first one. The first freaking one who was ever scanned. 
I'm, t I'm calling it. Here's some. Uh, Strasky, come in. I need help in the lab, the scan room. What happened? Conrad killed himself after the scan. Jesus, how? Um, laser tool. What should I do? I'm gonna need to tell Strohmeyer. No, please. I'm so close. Strohmeyer's gonna shut down the ARC project. It's not my fault people keep killing themselves. Catherine, what are you gonna do? It's not like you can sneak a 300-pound body out of the lab. I know. Catherine, are you okay? Not even close. Munchie was the guy at the beginning, Dr. Munchie. They, this is like... Are they immortal? I, I don't get it. I mean, these, she can't stop. These people believe in this so much that they're getting scanned and then they're killing themselves. Because their copy will, like, live on. Yeah, he wasn't even a, a doctor. Welcome to my place. When I started the art project, I pretty much lived in this lab. I assume this is going to be we'll broke see. too. Yeah, I'm going to have to go to the sub level to fix this. Yeah. Ooh. Where does this go? Not in there. Scared for a second. Yeah, it is kind of like a cult, isn't it? Freaking weird, man. It's so weird. I love it. This is where I would store the arc scans. So you saved the whole staff digitally on these chips? That was the plan. Oh, they're Damaged. fried. These are people's minds, I guess. Or okay. copies of them. I missed a room. Alright, I'll go back. Bust. These are all busted, man. Are there any that are intact? Oh, there's one. An intact memory chip. If we're lucky, we might be able to extract the cipher from it. Cherry, thank you so much for the continued support of the channel. That'll be a long time. Consciousnesses, yeah. Like them. That's freaking people, man. Oh, this one's really busted up. No, not on that one, I don't think. No. Huh, <laughs> yeah. And somebody's brain. Sorry. Sorry, bro. You're good, Bill Murray. You're good, man. I, I completely understand. This is like... Look, this is like Bill in accounting. F you, Bill. Never liked you anyway. Alright. We gotta reset the router in this freaking sub level. Oh! That opened right up, didn't it?